Hi you guys, welcome back to the vlog. It is PC update day, Monday for me. Um, I'm just not getting started. It's about 10.36. I just brought um, I just unplugged my old PC, brought it to the kitchen, and then brought my new stuff out here too, because we're just gonna do it at the kitchen table like we did, or like I did last time. I'm feeling confident. I watched a, I'm feeling pretty confident. Like I watched a couple videos last night and I was like, this is fine. I got this, I'm not too worried. So we'll see how that goes. So we got a pile of new stuff here, and then we have the old case here, which is just so big and clunky. <sighs> All right, so the plan is to just start taking things from one PC and moving it over is the plan. The only thing that I am, like not even worried, just a little like thoughtful about is the fans because apparently the fans I did not plug in correctly last time like they're powered they turn on but I did not connect the RGB correctly so I could never change the color of the fans they were just stuck on rainbow let's get this going I'm gonna open up this case and at least get the motherboard out of it and then open up the new motherboard and go from there there is like a ringing noise and I think it's in the other apartment, but it sounds like something is plugged up and it needs to be unplugged. Like it's just like this weird constant ring. I hate it, <sighs> but I'll ignore it. Let's get to work. I don't want to spend all day on this random tiny screw. But yeah, I'm going to get this thing open and get the stuff I want out of it, out of it. I just only have so much desk space. I think I might actually put you guys on the big tripod so I can have more surface area. That should be okay. All right, so I'm gonna unplug all of these things down here and I think I should be able just to lift it out once I unscrew the points. to the side for now. Somewhere where the cats can't get to it. Pia, leave it alone. No. Okay. Mischievous Pia was already messing with the old tower. She can't help herself, <laughs> but she ran off. Instantly, it is so warm in here. Oh, yeah. Wi Fi stuff. Oh no, battery flashing. Uh, no, this part looks empty. They're just playing with me. Let me switch out this battery and pull up a YouTube video so I can step by step because off of memory, I feel like I know what I'm doing, but I'd rather follow a video. I'm kind of thinking I want to start with taking this off. I think I need to use alcohol to clean the thermal paste. Also, I don't remember the name of any of these parts. I believe this is a CPU cooler. And then the thing underneath the little chip piece is the actual CPU. 
when I built this computer forever ago, I knew all the names and all that stuff. But now I'm just like, I don't know. My screwdriver's too big. Whew. All right, we got that off. Ooh, we got some pretty dried thermo paste on there, and I think I need alcohol and such to get it off. on let me get some alcohol or whatever and some q-tips try to clean this off and then I'll put some new thermal paste on it all right got a nice portion of that off and I actually had a open thermal paste already so I might go ahead and return the one that I have if this one's still any good Oh yeah. Do a little wipey wipe. It's probably entirely too much, but it's okay. And then we'll, I guess I need to wipe that off a little bit. I don't know if I'm supposed to. This is getting spooky. Okay, how it was before, it was this way. All right, there we go. That's on there. And let's see what, I know I feel like I'm kind of moving ahead, but I feel like I'm doing good. I'm feeling confident. Okay, you guys can't see that, but I'm putting these in two and four, like how I had it last time. Pretty sure I have to add a riser right here. My nose is officially running. I think that's all the parts that were on this motherboard. I think we can go ahead and put it back in its box and put it back to the side. I don't know where to put it. Ah! Okay, I'm gonna move this to the side because now we're gonna get the PC case open and hopefully everything's okay with it because I bought it over a month ago and it's been in the box the whole time. So hopefully no damage because I'm pretty sure it's outside of its return window. So let me, let me make some more space for myself and I'll be right back. I'll be right back. I think what we're gonna do is take the PC out of the box from the floor and lift it to the table because I don't have space. This is the same kitchen table I put the other case, the other PC together on and yet it somehow feels like I have less space. I don't know. Ugh. I honestly wanna just tear the whole box, but I think I just want to rip the box and slide it out this way instead of up. Okay, hold on. Oh. Okay, <laughs> not safe. You know what? I'm gonna lay the box on its side and pull it out that way. Like, duh. Cats are gonna go crazy for all this styrofoam. What a heaven. Cat heaven. Right there. And get this up on the table. Ugh. This PC case is a lot lighter than the other one, which I like, because the other one was just so heavy. Ooh. 
no cracks, nothing. It's so pretty. I love this case. It looks like a fish tank. That's such a pretty case. Eee. <laughs> Very excited. Um, I need to read the manual on how to get this thing open. I think this, yep, that just lifts off. And then we have to unscrew the rest, get all the glass off. My old PC case is taking up so much room. All right, we got a manual. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful steps. I will be using them. So you take the top off, and then that looks like the side. I think it wants me to start on the side. So it's saying there's gonna be a lip. So here, take the lip off. Oh, it's getting hot. My hair is already, I'm feeling it. I should get like a bowl so I can keep all these in. We got a Hello Kitty little dish. And that's where we'll keep all our screws. Okay, so take that off and then I should be able to lift the front glass off now. Why does it seem like it's still attached somewhere? I don't wanna break it. Oh, there we go. Haha. -ha. I'm moving all my glass over to, I can, over to the desk. All right, back panel, back panel's off. Then I was supposed to remove the top. Okay, it wants me to screw the fans on. Let's take this fan off since I'm not keeping this one. Actually, that can wait. We're gonna open up our new fans because it says we're go ahead and screw them to the top of this thing. We'll get the old fans out of the other PC in a second. Okay. All right, I think what I want, so last time when I put my PC together, I put the fans on the wrong way, and now I'm learning that there's an arrow, and if the wherever the arrow is pointing, that's where air is going. So I guess this is my intake, this is my outtake, and I want the fans, because there's fans at the bottom of the PC that are blowing air in so if i want this air in that i think i'm going to continue that and have air going out right air in air out and then i'll do this one in and then these two in or should i have them going out i don't know i'll think about it let me get these screwed on to the the mount really quick I believe they go this way. Actually, they may go this way. Let me look at the. Nope, they go under, like that. Let me get these on here. I'm sweating. It is now 12:30, and I have. I got all my fans in. I have all my fans in and I have my motherboard in. So now, what am I doing? I guess now I need to connect all my fans. I need to figure out what cords go to what because there's so many screws and cords and things and I'm just like, well, what, where does, where does this go? Like. This is like a Wi-Fi thing. So I'm putting things to the side that I for sure don't need. And my legs are shaking. I've been standing up, hovering over this thing for so long that now I'm just like, ooh. Like, I think this is my guide. Like, it feels impossible that that was all I had to do. Like, I still have my motherboard here. Like, I know this has to be fastened in, but there's like, Oh, my power supply needs to go in here. Like, so many things, so many things. And like, 
this is crazy deceptive like it makes it look like oh you just plug this in plug this in it just feels like um it feels like things are missing it feels like things are missing maybe this case is just super simple and it didn't need as many things as the other one like i don't know let me stand this up and get the motherboard in or get the power supply in here i'm waiting to the end to put the um graphics card and stuff in there okay so here's the test i think i have everything connected and I'm gonna plug it in and see what happens. Very nervous. I've been at this all day. It has to be after three o'clock at this point. So it's plugged in, flip the power, and I see the motherboard lights are turning on. Let's press power. This is not turning. Oh, this is not connected. <laughs> um, I believe that goes, that pin goes in there. Everything else is turning on. All my lights, ooh, my top lights are not spinning. My back lights are not spinning. All right. I think I know what that's about. We're getting there. <laughs> I'm so excited. Um, let me turn this all off and connect to the things that I see are not connected. Let me take this back into the kitchen and finish plugging in the stuff. I need to plug in my CPU or is this a CPU? What is that? Is the CPU cooler? That's not plugged in. And then my fans are not connected correctly. So it's like I connected the RGB, but I did not connect the actual fans to each other. Only one of the fans is connected to the motherboard. So let me fix that. We're back. I feel so tired and drained. We're gonna plug everything up and see what happens. I have the monitor plugged in. I should have all my things plugged in. I gotta figure out which one of these is my mouse and which one is my keyboard so I can plug those in. I feel like I'm gonna just plug everything in because I don't know which of these razor cords are what. Ramsey, hey buddy. Ramsey, can you not? I'll pick you up in a second, I promise. You're just pulling on me. Come here. All right. Let's see what happens. Everything. You pulled all on me and now I have you. We gotta flip that. All right, here we go. My top fans are not spinning. My bottom fans are spinning. Everything is spinning besides my top fans. And my monitor's not turning on. Wait a minute. Come on, monitor. It is so hot and I'm trying to do this and Ramsey is trying, he's being very affectionate and clingy right now, but he's getting on my nerves. I need you to, I need you to go be independent right now, okay? Be independent. Mommy's hungry, it's hot, okay, she's sweating, your hair is all in the air. All right, let's plug the, we'll plug the monitor into a different port. Monitor is not cutting on, huh? Let me figure this out. It's on, oh my gosh, I was sitting here forever just unplugging and plugging things in and I did an HDMI and it's plugged into my graphics card instead of the motherboard. And my display port is not plugged in at all. I'll go back to display port in a second, but I just wanted to make sure I got everything on. It is literally 
4.43. I have been at this all day. Like this is a shift at work. All my fans are on. Let it do its little update, but I think we're good. I don't know why that's not spinning. Is that okay? Does it only turn on if it needs to be? Okay, so apparently it's not gonna spin unless it needs to spin, so that's okay. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna get me a fat ass burger. I deserve it. Let me do all these updates really quick and I'm gonna have to, I have to unplug this thing and like, <laughs> I still gotta put all the panels back on. <laughs> okay, I'll be back. Okay, I think it's time to go ahead and rip the film off. How messy my desk is it's a mess <sighs> and wait gotta flip oh gotta plug in the power supply hold on all my fans are spinning monitor is turning on I think we're good I guess the real test is to see if all three of the or all four of these ports work. I don't think the USB-C is going to work because I don't have the, I have to buy an adapter. Ooh, oh, oh, okay. <laughs> I also figured out how to get my, my cooler fan to sync up with everything else. Apparently I still had the box and all the original stuff from when I bought that like forever ago. So I still had the cords. I need to look up if we can change the color on the little ram sticks but if not everything else changes color and I think it's really cute it fits nicely underneath my shelf because the other one was way too big and it did not fit I am so hot like I'm about to go get a burger um let me show you guys how I have all are my fans at the bottom spinning yeah they're spinning let me let me show you guys the fans so you can tell me if I should move any fans or change directions fans in the bottom are blowing up so tell me which fans I should change. Everything is blowing out besides the ones at the bottom, they're blowing in. So tell me, what's the best thing to do? Like, should I change, turn this one around and make it an out or make it an in? Should I flip this one and make it an in so it's pulling in air? Or should I turn these and so they're bringing in, in air? Or should it be the ones at the top? Well, no, I don't feel like the ones at the top because my cats sit up here and I just think if they sit up here it's going to be pulling dirty air in and cat hair versus if it's blowing up then it won't be sucking in dirt. So I'm going to leave these three at the top but should these be in or should these be out? I'm hungry. It's 6.28. I literally spent my whole day doing this. I'm about to... I'm trying to think should I get the cats dinner now no I'm gonna put my clothes on get my food and then come home and then that it should be dinner time for them so I will be right back I'm gonna get food I'm not gonna make it starting this little clip because I was not expecting those mini verses that I bought yesterday to show up today they said they were coming on Monday so they're here and I wanted to open them up um I know this I'm just inserting this clip Okay, I don't even know where this is gonna go in the vlog because this vlog is supposed to be like a PC update vlog. Uh, yeah. Also, I went to TJ Maxx today and I got this cute little container to put little tech stuff on my shelf in the office. It was in like a little plastic shoe box, but I didn't really like the way that looked. This looks way cuter and it keeps all my cords and things safe from my cat's nibbling nibblers. I kind of want to get two more, like one for hair accessories and then one extra. It's just like for who knows what. I also got snacks. The whole idea was to go to TJ Maxx and find clothes. Didn't find any clothes. I give up. But I got these. These look so good. 
And for whatever reason, they're telling me that I can put these in the oven and bake them. Might, I was just gonna eat them right out the thing, but warm, toasty s'mores might be really good. So, might be doing that at some point. Um, I went to a Kohl's because it was there and was in the, they had just opened it up. So it was like a Kohl's Sephora. So I went in and I got the Laneige Vanilla lip balm that I like. I wanted to get the sweet candy one, but I was like, let me not get crazy because I do have a gummy bear one in the office. There's a berry one in my purse and then there's a peppermint and a grapefruit. It might be, no, it might be peppermint and mango in my desk and now I have this. Like I have too many un, like this will be the third unopened one that I have. I have an addiction to Laneige lip products and I got this Hammond's cookie dough chocolate bar. I like these. At Target, I think it was around Christmas time or something, they had some of these at Target and it was like a pigs in a blanket, not pigs in a blanket. I don't know, it was pig something. And it had bacon and potato chips. I really liked that one. And they had a s'mores one. And then this one, and I think like a sea salt and caramel one, but I got cookie dough because I was like, why not? Anywho, let's open up their mini brands so I can get back to laying around. It's Sunday for me. Now there should be four in here to open. Four? Yeah, four, that makes sense. And then I still have one coming on Tuesday. So I'll probably be inserting that somewhere in this vlog. Maybe I'll do a little moving content around and I'll just add it on the end of this so that it's all together. Um, really excited. I don't remember which ones I said I was looking forward to. Like I'm pretty sure chicken noodle soup, cereal, and some of the cute little desserts. All right, I'm gonna change the camera angle. Also, do you guys like my hair? I did the two little buns. I thought it was like very like 90s, 2000s to have the buns that are messy on both sides. Very cute. But let's turn you guys around. I do have my balcony door open just because it was raining and really windy and I thought I was gonna be letting in fresh air. Praying for no duplicates. <laughs> oh no, the pen mark is in the same spot as on both of these, these might be duplicates. <sighs> That's so unlucky. If it's a duplicate, if it's something cute, I'll keep it. But if it's something that I don't want, I'll just give to Taylor. If she even liked the other ones I got, gave her. Same exact color bags. They're for sure duplicate poop. What is it though? Oh, I'm so sad. Made fresh. What is it? Oh, we got a donut. Okay. We got glaze. Um, a little serving plate. It's got a little wood grain kind of look to it. And this is most likely like sprinkles or something. Oh, cute. It's the little party sprinkles. So this is most likely like the pink donuts, which are very cute. I'm not mad at that. Chiny. Please put, you guys hear that wind? That wind is crazy, but cute little donuts. There's two of them in there. So it seems like I got these right here. That's really cute too on the tray, but I think I got these. 
I'm looking for the pinhole or the mark. Okay, there's a mark here. A little pin the hole there. And then there's another one that's like right here, slightly off to the side. Slightly different positions, very close to each other though. I'm like looking like the colors of the bags inside are very similar. So scared. Please no duplicates. A huge thing of Pico. What could that be? Because that's bigger than the Pico I had yesterday. <gasps> the purple corn chips. So it's the purple version of the one I had yesterday. Okay, so this one is going to be the purple corn version. And it has the little... Okay. Whoa, I would have wanted something different. But this always happens to me. I'll get so excited about opening these all up. And so I'll buy a bunch. And then when I go to open them, I get disappointed on the second round. And then I'm just like, whatever. <gasps> this one's hot dogs. Okay, if this one's different. I'm excited. So now it's either ketchup hot dogs or mustard hot dogs. I think it's ketchup hot dogs because I think the yellow little thing came with ketchup hot dog. Then that little paper goes in there, I think. And here is our ketchup. And these must be the buns. Yep, we got our bag of hot dog buns. We got two buns in there. Very cute. Put everything back. Still really sad I didn't get a bowl of cereal. And this one really didn't have that many different variations. I just wanted a bowl of cereal. And I'm happy I got donuts because these are the cuter of the donuts because they're just like Simpson donuts. And I would have liked either of the bobas, but it's okay. The lime refresher is really cute pineapple smoothie there's just so many cute options but it's okay maybe i'll get a bowl of cereal at some other point in something else and then for this one this one this one right here had all the cute stuff in it like why why would i get this one again i'm so sad another thing of the pika or the nachos i would have liked the churros, like churros, any of these cute little things, and the soup. I have a problem. Like now I wanna go to Target. <laughs> now I wanna go to Target or Walmart and stand in the aisle and look for the pinholes for the ones that I want because I'm about to spend like 20 more dollars like why am i spending a small fortune on these things i just really want the little chocolate raspberry dessert i want that one um i really don't care about the chocolate covered strawberries those are cute but i really don't care and i want this root beer or do i maybe i don't want root beer maybe i want this cherry vanilla float that looks really cute I want the pretzels. Like, I want those. Either of the popcorns are cute, preferably the caramel corn. But vegetable soup, letter soup. What is that? Alphabet soup. I want that. And that's all. Like, I won't get greedy. That's enough. I'm out of here. And we'll see where the rest of the vlog takes us. Last one just showed up. Let's get this open. Um, yeah. <sighs> you guys, I just got done building my PC. Let's see what our options are. Ooh, not that many. Um, okay, this looks like it has ice. 
there's ice. That means it's one of the drinks. Oh, chocolate syrup. Do you think it's one of the Choco Bear Pops? No, couldn't be that. I'm like, don't let it be s'mores. It's already ha oh, it's s'mores. I'm pretty sure I already have this one. I'm pretty sure I have this one. Got the marshmallows. I'm pretty sure. Oh, what are the chances? You order a random one and it's exactly the one you already have. Out of all the options, you get a duplicate. <laughs> and I bought the other one from Target. Specifically, I went to Target and was filling up all the balls looking for um, the pin mark. But it's okay. The s'mores one is really cute, so I don't mind. Ah! I feel like it's kind of dark in here, but I was about to say like, oh, it's Thursday for me, but it's not. It's only Wednesday for me. And I went to three different stores trying to find the mini brands that I wanted and I could not find any of the ones I wanted. I went to Walmart. They only had like more recent ones that I didn't want. I went to Meyer and I went to Target. And after Target, I was just like, forget it. I'll just get two of these. And it's supposed to be chicken noodle soup and pickles. Those are the two I got. Cause they only had a uh, series three. So they had series three of the cafe and then series three of whatever the other one is called. But I only wanted burger out of that one and I already have it. So I was just like, all right, never mind. So yeah. Maybe all the ones I got from Amazon, they're on sale or just kind of out of being slowly phased out because they're out of style or out of, they're like an old series, which is fine. I still really want that um, alphabet soup. <laughs> so bad. I can't remember what other one I want. I feel like alphabet soup was the main one I wanted. If they're still on sale when I get paid again, I might go on there and buy like a couple more. I get paid again next week. And if they're still on sale, battery's flashing. I'll buy some more. Um, let's see what we got here. We got stock. All right, I think this is my chicken noodle soup. They also had a set that was like a drink machine and I'm kind of interested. It was like you plug the liquid into the machine, tip it upside down, you press the lever and then it would come out like a drink dispenser and you can like make drinks. And I'm like, um, they were a little bit more expensive. They were like $12, but I think it's because it comes with the dispenser that you would keep. Uh, we got some little noodles. Cute. Once I make all these, I'm seriously, wait a minute. Why are the, oh, it's not noodles. These are chicken strips. It's a chicken strip, that's why there's a chicken on it because these are the noodles. That's so cute. Focus, please. Oh my God, my camera. All right, we got little veggies. The packaging alone is so cute. This is like my favorite obsession and then here's the bowl oops there's a little bowl you're gonna put your soup in that is so cute let me lay these on the table really quick and then I'll put them back in the box I want to open up the pickles really quick before my battery dies I really I kind of wanted some of the Willy Wonk they had um like the Easter one still out and there's a chance you could have got the Willy Wonka box of chocolates. I really would have liked that, but um, there's no way to know which one's the Willy Wonka box of chocolates unless you open it and peek because it would have a gold wrapper instead of being ham. It would have a gold wrapper. Maybe I'll try again. Maybe I will. I really would like to get the box of chocolates. So maybe I'll go back to Walmart and try to find the ham 
and then after so I mean there has to be I'm rambling it doesn't matter but here's a little jar for the pickles a little mason jar uh, we got mustard seeds One of these guys would be the little pickle spears. Oh, here are the pickle spears. And then maybe this is the brine. Oh, it's vinegar. And it has a little... So we got some vinegar and the little spout. So you would pour it all into the jar. You put your pickles and your seeds in there and cure it. And it'll look like a jar of pickles. So cute. I'm telling, oh, it even comes with stickers. So you can put stickers on your jar. That's so cute. They've done it again. They did it. Um, I don't want any more out of this series. Honestly, I'm making them into magnets anyway. So it really doesn't matter. I can like buy them and then eventually make them into magnets and then the prophecy will be fulfilled. Let me put these all away and I'll check back in tomorrow after work. I'm not really doing anything right now except re-watching the first season of Interview with the Vampire again because it's my favorite. So I already re-watched the whole season but now I'm about to go back and re-watch my favorite episodes. And yeah, I need to go back and watch Netflix while I still have it but I just like watching my favorite stuff on repeat instead. Okay, I got my partner sitting here with me. She's cute. Oh, she wants to leave. But, okay. Be back tomorrow. I'm putting trash in this bag. Like, I don't still have allergy pills and stuff in here. What the heck? And my extra strength Tylenol because I had a migraine yesterday and all I had was ibuprofen. I had to just go to bed because... That's all I could do. I hope this looks pink on camera. I guess I won't know until I go to edit. I feel like my eyeballs show it's pink, but on camera, not as pink. Very cute though. Really excited because now finally my I can change the color of all my fans before I didn't have everything connected so the fans could change colors. And I changed the background on my computer. Very cute. Coming in so we can wrap this vlog up so I can start editing probably tonight or tomorrow and then start a new vlog. So yeah, love the new PC build. It went pretty good. Um, let me show you something really quick because I'm like, hi low-key annoyed but it's fine so as soon as i got done building that pc enjoy my life within the next couple days i get on tiktok and height announces that they are doing like a new colors like they're doing new colors of the same case that i got heartbreak <sighs> oh and they're pre order so they wouldn't be coming until September. So it's not like I could buy it now and then return the one I have. I'm just, like, I'm just stuck with it. So I'm like, oh my God, it's so cute. And they're doing pink, um, I think purple and blue. So cute. I think it's called like the Milky Collection or something like that. They're like milky, like kind of pastel colors. It's fine. I also wish I would have got a uh, Corsair fans because the Corsair colors are better. Like something about the colors are a little bit more true for the RGB because when I'm doing my Cooler Master fans, I'm always having to choose colors slightly darker than the actual color for it to show up on the fan. So if I choose like a dark green, it's gonna translate to a light green in the fans. But the Corsair, like my little Ram sticks, I choose one color and it's like the perfect shade of pink. No, no stress about it. There's not as many color options, but the colors you get are just like perfect. But it's fine. I'm not getting new fans. Um, I'm not getting a new case. I'm just gonna enjoy the one that I have and that's just gonna be it. Uh, also, confession. <laughs> I 
swear I'm not gonna buy any more of those mini verses but today I literally went to three different Walmarts two different Walgreens uh two different targets looking for mini verse balls like the issue is the alphabet soup and the fruity cereal are from like older series so a lot of places don't have that series anymore they have the current series so i got on amazon and i bought a bunch and they're coming tomorrow but i'm not doing it anymore like i there i have to stop the bunch i bought tomorrow is going to be the last bit and then i won't do it no more and then i'm gonna do i'm gonna work on crafts um, I saw picture frames. You can like do a plain little picture frame and put the little mini verses around it. I saw um, fridge magnets. You know, we're going to stop. You heard it here. We're stopping. Um, I did stop by TJ Maxx because I saw these online and I was like, well, let me go see if I can find them in store. So cute for the cat's bathroom. And I always love all the cat pictures that are at TJ Maxx, but they never have any that look like my cats, so I never buy them. Ramsey's a little bit closer, like this cat, this is the closest, like this looks like Ramsey. It's a little bit more brown. He's a little bit more black and gray, but that looks like Ramsey. So I got this one and then I got this one because it has a bunch of different cats in it. So there's several cats that are at the focus and I figured I put them in the cat's bathroom on the wall just like that. And we're just going to do a cat themed bathroom. I don't know when it's going to happen, but I want that bathroom to be cat themed and I'm going to clean it up, make it all cute because it's supposed to be like a guest bathroom slash cat bathroom, but I don't have guests. It's the cat's bathroom. So I'm just buying stuff to go in there so far. Not gonna do much, like a rug, uh, maybe one of those behind the toilet shelves to like put stuff on. The cats can go sit on it because they like to sit up high. And I don't know, stuff like that. I'm not gonna get too crazy, just like simple things. <sighs> I might even tie in, do you see how like each picture has little ducks in it? So I may be able to do like cats and rubber ducks because I've, I haven't found any cute like cat soap dispensers, but I have seen cute rubber duck soap dispensers. So we might do a little cat rubber duck situation for the cat bathroom. Um, also last week, I didn't show you guys this, but look what I got on clearance. The pink one for only $10. And there was nothing wrong with it. Like I was looking around on it thinking it had a crack, but only $10 versus this one. I'm pretty, oh, oh my gosh. You relax. Um, yeah, I paid 20 for this one. And only 10 for this one for clearance. So very happy about that. Little matching areas, won't buy any more of those. They did have the one with the gold bow, gold bow on clearance. They had two of them, but I was like, you know what? I don't need it. I don't need it. So I didn't get it. Hopefully this vlog is like, it seems like it's out of focus. Yeah. Hopefully the footage is worth looking at. I, hopefully this vlog is interesting. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do next vlog. I think I might do like nails, might put some mini verse together. I don't know. Let me know what you guys want to see. Maybe we'll go try that cheese it uh, crunch wrap from Taco Bell. And there's definitely going to be a little bit mini verse unboxing because um, I don't even want to tell you guys how many I, how much I spent, but I'll tell you how many are coming tomorrow from Amazon. And then that'll be the last I do but I'm definitely gonna open this like this will be the third vlog where I've opened up miniverse so hopefully you guys enjoy looking at them and we'll actually put some together bought four eight nine ten eleven eleven of them are coming tomorrow ah <laughs> I'm stopping though all right I'm gonna wrap up this vlog um, if you made it this far, leave me a computer emoji. I don't know how many computer. I know there's a laptop one. I don't know if there's a desktop or leave a computer mouse, whatever computer theme emoji you want to leave, go ahead and leave it. And I will see you guys next week. Um, I don't know what I'm about to do for the rest of the day. I think I might go see a movie. I still have several movies I need to go see. And 
I just want to chill. I want to do my nails, just relax. All right, bye you guys. Thanks for watching. You're the best. Bye.